ready to lace up your sneakers to help in the fight against pancreatic cancer. The Purple Stride Charlotte 5K Run and Walk coming up in September. We're talking about it early because we want it on your calendar. I want to welcome Mark Weber. Thank he you. is the Media Relations Chair of the Charlotte Pancreatic Cancer Action Network, as well as Harry L. Jones Sr. He is a pancreatic cancer survivor and author. If you recognize him, he used to be the county manager for Mecklenburg County. So I, I'm thrilled to have both of you here tonight. Thank you for having me. Thank you for having us. And, and I know that this is a cause that is personal for both of you. Mark, let's start with you. It is. So, you know, they say lightning doesn't strike twice, and in my situation, it did. In uh, 2004, my father-in-law, who was like a second dad to me, he was diagnosed with pancreatic cancer, and unfortunately, he lost his battle about mm -hmm. nine months later. And then seven years later, my mother was diagnosed with pancreatic cancer, and she lost her battle about five months later. So it's deeply personal. I got mad. And I'm like, I'm not going to stand for this, and I want to see this changed. Harry, I want to uh, bring you into the conversation. You are a pancreatic cancer survivor, which people may not realize what a big deal that is. Well, it is a big deal. I got diagnosed back in 2011, December of 2011, four and a half uh, years ago. Mm. Um, I have a strong will to live, and I just decided that when I got diagnosed, um, that I was not that I was going to live with cancer and not die from cancer, and so I just put. There are two things that happened to me. One, I put my faith and trust in God, uh, and I tried to work with the medical team as best I could to ensure that, um, that I would beat this, and I just knew going in that I would. All right. The power of positive thinking and just sheer will. Um, talk about, Mark, this 5K that's coming up in September and the importance of it. Yeah, it's extremely important. So we are promoting this early, right? It's in September. But Purple Stride, it is a way for us to really unite the community. And what we do is we bring people together to create awareness for pancreatic cancer and to put money into research. We need more money in order to figure out early detection. And that's what this is all about. Right now, there are no early detection methods. Oh, wow. Uh, and and the proceeds will go toward uh, research for the Re Charlotte? Yeah, it goes for research and it also mm -hmm. goes to support patients who have been diagnosed with pancreatic cancer. Uh, Harry, you, talk, you authored a book about this, How Cancer Cured My Soul. Yeah, I wrote this book. Um, I read a book called The Practice of the Presence of God, Chronicles and Teachings of a 16th Century Cleric by the name of Brother Lawrence. Mm -hmm. And in that book, uh, he wrote to another patient who had been sick that sometimes he said that God diseases the body in order to cure the diseases of the soul. And that just um, jumped out at me. And I wanted to write a book to encourage people who are going through challenges in their life to give them hope, to inspire them that no matter what they might face, that if they would live within the moment and appreciate the beauty that surrounds them, that things will be okay. And the book has been very well received uh, with that particular message. And um, I would hope that those who would read it uh, would find um, uh, some inspiration and that they find some hope, whatever challenge they might be facing. It doesn't have to be yeah. cancer. Yeah. It could be anything in your life. But we're all going to face some challenges in our life. Uh, really quickly before we get to this full screen, the warning signs for pancreatic cancer. Warning signs. So what's challenging about this disease is the warning signs can be vague. Um, but digestive issues, um, people sometimes turn jaundice or they turn yellow, and mm -hmm. that's a really key sign. Okay. Back pain is also very common. Okay. We recommend if people have anything, listen to your body and push. Harry can vouch for this. You have to be your own best number one advocate. Okay. Yeah, I was an advocate for my, myself. I okay. mean, I remember going to my doctor and saying something is wrong and I want to test today, and I don't care if my insurance approves the test. If I have to mortgage my house to pay for it, I, I want to test know. it. But I knew that something was That's wrong. wrong. Mm -hmm. All right. The 5K coming up Saturday, September 10th. The run and walk begins at 8.30 a.m. have to mention our own Maureen O'Boyle. She is going to be yes. the MC for the event. Marshall Park in Uptown Charlotte, WBTV, also a sponsor. Something we're very proud to be involved with. Uh, more information on uh, how you can register, log on to WBTV.com, the Web Extra section under the Home tab. Mark, Harry, thank you so much thank uh, for you. being here tonight. So much of it is about raising awareness. It I feel is. like we only talk about pancreatic cancer when you hear about a celebrity or someone high profile getting it. You know, yeah. you think Patrick Swayze, people right. know pancreatic cancer, uh, but clearly a lot of folks living with it and battling it. It is. Thank you for having us. We Absolutely. appreciate it. So much. Thank you. Thank you. Um, and as the days get hotter, so does your car. Our final guest of the night is going to show you how to prepare the car to take the heat before summer road trips. We'll have him coming back after the break.